But I was having a hard time getting used to our new surroundings. Boom! Ah! Ah! <laughs> and then there was our great uncle Stan. That guy. <laughs> it was worth it. I wouldn't be surprised if the man of my dreams walked through that door right now. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, not good. Oh. Wendy, I need you to put up this sign. I would, but I uh, can't uh, reach it. Uh. I'd fire all of you if I could. Grunkle Stan, is this going to be anything like our last family bonding day? You call that Ben Franklin? He looks like a woman. Uh-oh. All right. Maybe I haven't been the best summer caretaker. But I swear, today we're going to have some real family fun. Now, who wants to put on some blindfolds and get into my car? Yay! Wait, what? Now that we're alone, Rosanna, there's a burning question which my heart longs to ask of you. Oh, Reginald. Hey! Wanna hear a joke? Here goes. My ex-wife still misses me, but her aim is getting better. Her aim is getting better. You see, it's, it's funny because marriage is terrible. What? Whoa. It's a secret wax museum. They're so lifelike. Except for that one. Hello! Ah! Ah! <laughs> it's just me, your Grunkle Stan! Ah! Ah! Sorry, Grunkle Stan, but we've got a big break in the case. Break in the case! We're heading into town right now to interrogate the murderer. We have an axe! Re, re, re! Ah, this seems like the kind of thing a responsible parent wouldn't want you doing. Good thing I'm an uncle. Avenge me, kids! Avenge me! I must warn you, these statues come at a terrible price. Twenty dollars? I'll just take them when you're not looking. What? I said I was gonna rob you. <laughs> Get in, you little punk! Open up! I will pardon nothing. Well, hey, Gideon, look what... Stand for pines, I rebuke thee. I rebuke thee. Rebuke? Is that a word? The entire Pines family have invoked my fury. You will all pay recompense for your transgressions. What, you got like a word a day calendar or something? Las Torres. You're all fired. You're watching the black and white period piece Old Lady Boring Movie Channel. Kids! I can't find the remote and I refuse to stand up! Stay tuned for the Friday Night Movie, The Duchess Approved, starring Sterling Stemble Burgess as The Duchess and Grafton St. Rumpter Frabble as the irascible Coxswain Sauterblug at Hamter Fuppenshire. Kids! No! No! Come on, Grunkle Stan, pick up! Oh, what is he doing? or his royal highness Lionel of Cornwall. I'm not afraid anymore, mother. Duchess, I forbid you. I may be a duchess, but I'm also a woman. Yes, yes, in your face, Elizabeth. <laughs> it's just like my life, <laughs> in a way. Ah, the wedding. I've waited so long for this. Oh, look at her in that dress. Count Lionel? What's he doing here? I've come to reclaim my bride. You had your chance at the cotillion, you! You had your chance at the cotillion, you! That's what I'm saying! Uh... uh couldn't find the remote. How about these crystals? That looks like broken glass. What are you, a cop? Lazy Susan, there's my little ray of sunshine. Where were you yesterday? I got hit by a bus. <laughs> Hilarious. But, Grunkle Stan, I want pancakes. With the fancy flour they use these days? <laughs> what am I, made of money? Tap, tap. Okay, Grunkle Stan, you started like this, but you became... Can I scratch myself now? No, 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 no! Is that throw up on your shirt? I don't know how to answer that. <sighs> Right, like I'm gonna fall for that. 
Give me that, buddy, buddy! <laughs> and then Zeus came by and talked to me for like an hour. You've been through so much. All right, all right. I got a job for you two. I printed up a bunch of fake safety inspection certificates. Go slap one on anything that looks like a lawsuit. Uncle Stan, is that legal? When there's no cops around, anything's legal. <sighs> what was I thinking? I can't fight. I've never been in a fight before. Look at these noodle arms. Just bonk him over the head. It's nature's snooze button. I was awoken by the sound of mockery. Where is it? Show me the object of ridicule. I'm taller than Dipper. By one millimeter. Hey, hey, don't get short with your sister. <laughs> now, Grunkle Stan, I hope you don't think little of him. <laughs> yeah, and, and, uh, he's short. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Wash off the shame, Stan. Wash off the shame. Ha! <laughs> he thought he could scare us. <gasps> eh? What's that? <laughs> <laughs> Still got it. And don't stop till you've covered that sign with glitter. Glittery signs attract tourists. Also large birds. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That's funny. Ugh, this line is taking forever. Time to use my old man powers. Ah! I'm having a heart attack! And the only cure is to be a contestant on, on Cash Wheel! No! Someone give me a part! I'm old! Should we escort him off the lot? That man is a self-centered attention hog with no regard for human decency. Get him on TV! Now let's meet those contestants. I'm Doug from Fairfield, California. From I'm home. Stan, Stan Pines! <laughs> did we do we already do me? Hello? I'm Stan! <laughs> okay, well, it's gonna be a long night, folks. <laughs> it's time to solve. <laughs> it's uh time to solve that puzzle. Carla! Yes, Rich? Are there any S's? Actually, it's not your turn yet. <laughs> I'm ready to solve! No, the game hasn't started. Is it shut your yaps? Well played. Cash shower, cash shower, cash shower. Cash shower! Yes! Mr. Pines, no, you don't need to take your clothes off. No, go to commercial. Go to commercial! Well, it looks like we're down here for the long haul. Who wants to see some card tricks? Ta-da! Ready? Spin, Spin the, the pig! pig. Woo! Hey, Uncle Stan, ever kissed a pig before? I'm not gonna answer that question. I can't believe this nonsense. Magic tonics? Zeus winning at something? Where do you come up with this stuff? I'll tell you a good story. It's called Grunkle Stan Wins the Football Bowl. <laughs> Mr. Pines, I thought old folks were useless, but you taught me and my gloating friends a lesson. Yeah. Here's your football winning trophy, Mr. Pines. Thanks, beautiful woman, but I couldn't have done it without my sidekick, Footbot. Thank you for building me, Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Stan. Boo! Oh, Come on! Don't you do this. Dumb. What? That story was great. I even threw in a talking robot for the kids. And remember to be on alert for random wildfires. Wait, what? <laughs> He'll be fine. Yeah, nothing like sitting in a moist tub with strangers. It's like the bus, but wet. The coast is clear. Ah! Now all I have to do is wait here 15 hours until the pool opens. This was a good plan. Then we need to talk to Grunkle Stan about moving rooms. Yeah, he's a reasonable guy. <laughs> fight, fight, fight! Fight, fight, fight! <laughs> fight, fight, fight! Fight, fight, fight! Baby fights! TV, it knows what I want. This carpet is amazing! Yeah, if you're into things that are terrible. Gerard is just so fierce. What's going on, Dipper? <gasps> ah, you're at that creepy age where you spy on girls, huh? Guess it's time you and me had a man-to-man -man talk about the birds and the bees, you know? I, I should really be going- No way out of it!
Look, it all begins with this little fella, the pituitary gland. He may be little, but he has big plans. <coughs> and now you know where babies come from. Goodbye, childhood. You know, I find you more likable today than usual. Maybe you could still win that game after all. Huh? I was gonna give that new room to Mabel. No, you should! Give it to Mabel! You big jerk! What did you say to me? I said, uh, shut up, old man! You're fat and dumb and you're a dummy and take that! Finally standing up to me, huh? <laughs> I love it! You know, I've made up my mind. The room belongs to you, Dipper. You can't! You have to give it to Mabel! Shh! You had me at shut up, old man. Prepare to have your mind blown. Spit take, here I come. When I think about you, I feel feeling so deep. I'm tossing, turning, hmm. and you know That's not spit worthy. What gives? Wait a minute. Stan, rewind! Nielsen soon my one. You are now under my control. Your mind is mine. Holy mackerel! Now there's your spit take! Ha <laughs> ha! I knew it! It's mind control after all! Oh no! I gotta save Wendy! Finally, a good reason to punch a teenager in the face! Let's roll! <laughs> Wait a second! Is something rooting through our trash? <laughs> hey, hey! Get out of here! <laughs> Darn beautiful men! Always eating, eating out of my trash. Wait, what? People don't roll around in their own filth! Except for Seuss. We need a plan to get out of here. Okay, okay. How's about Mabel knit Seuss a pig costume? I like it. And we use Seuss as a human sacrifice. I like it. That's kind of sappy. Oh, what? That's how I feel. No, I mean... Oh, yeah. Gotcha! Ah. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We seem to have entered a dangerous game of cat and mouse. But the question remains, who is the cat and who is the... Seuss. Broom. Oh, no, not the broom! <laughs> Ow. 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 <laughs> Sir, would you like to buy a Stanvac vacuum? Stanvac! It sucks more than anything. Gotta work on that. Child psychic Gideon Gleeful has taken surprise ownership of the Mystery Shack, previously belonging to area shyster Stanford Pines. That picture's taken out of context. Now get off my property, old man! I'll show you who's the old man. Ow! Ah, my hearing aid! Thank